What's your favourite drink? Malibu and pineapple juice. <laughs> Sounds disgusting. Why is that your favourite drink? It tastes nice and you get drunk on it easily. <laughs> and how old are you? Fifteen. What's your favourite drink? Lager. And how old are you? Oh, I'm fifteen. What's your favourite drink? Lager. And how old are you? I'm sixteen. So tell me, how much do you all drink? Well, in the weekend, three to four pints a night. So what, how much do you drink? As much as I can afford. <laughs> until I can... Until I can throw up. <laughs> <laughs> Cheap, it's easily available. I could go into any off license and buy a drink. When I was 13, 14, same with the pubs. Nobody cares. It's about time something. You know, something happened, maybe. Uh, you know, maybe there won't be people like me who end up in the gutter, you know? If you would like more information about breaking the alcohol habit, you can phone 01388 2388 up to 1 a.m. tonight. The lines will be also open tomorrow morning from 10.30 to 1 p.m. Thames Television, together with the Health Education Authority and Alcohol Concern, have produced two publications to accompany this series. The free leaflet, Sensible Drinking, shows you how to measure your drinking and to cut down. And the Breaking the Habit Guide to Alcohol Education is filled with ideas and information about resources to help raise awareness of alcohol in your club, group or workplace. It costs £2.95 and checks should be made out to Thames Television. For either or both publications, please write to Breaking the Habit, PO Box 2LE, London, W1A 2LE. You can find out more by phoning 01388-2388 and this address can also be found in this week's TV Times. Cell Block H next, and it should be a happy day today, for at long last it's Karen's time before the parole board. She's kept her nose pretty clean, so it should be plain sailing, even without the help of Steve, the lawyer, who seems to have disappeared without a trace. Meanwhile, the death of the prisoner, Bella, is still casting a shadow over the walls of Wentworth Prison. B and Monica are suspected, but what was that that Nolene has given her daughter at visiting time? Can it be Bella's ring? If you're looking for a Fiat with this kind of space for the family, reliability, hatchback flexibility, and great economy, all with this unmistakable style, there's only one choice. The Fiat Uno, the most wanted small car in Europe, now comes with 0% finance and a free three-year warranty. We're looking for the ultimate fresh experience. Is it this huge lake of icebergs found by Nigel, or is it Radox Shower Fresh that Julie has discovered with its terrific range of fragrances? Nigel takes the icy plunge. Julie goes for the hair and body formula. Nigel loses his senses, but Julie gains some exciting new ones. Given the choice, I know where I'd rather be. Radox Shower Fresh for your hair and your body. The ultimate fresh experience. Every day, thousands of jobs are waiting to be filled. In fact, one in three firms predict skill shortages will affect output. So doesn't it make sense to train the workers without jobs to do the jobs without workers? That's why. From September, the government is investing 1.4 billion pounds in new employment training, which means your company's next generation of skilled workers could be custom trained for you, by you. Details phone free of charge 0800 24 6000. Kevin, where exactly did you bury the car? In the sand! I'm, I'm not helping much, am I, Dad? No, but I know a man who can. AA5 Star, motoring abroad. Mom? We're all you need to know. Yes, it, it could well have sand in the engine, yeah. You ain't seen nothing yet. But, but, but baby, you just ain't seen it nothing yet. Here's something, here's something you never forget, baby. You know, you know, you know, you just ain't seen it nothing yet. You ain't been around. The fight 
with a lot more clout. The new color daily mirror. Silly posturpedic beds, mucho luxurioso, and they equalize your body pressure. Yeah, yeah. So, with beds, there's the good, the bad. And it's ugly. <laughs> I enjoy some winter sports this time of year. I could sit for hours and watch them persevere. But the fruit and flakes of wheat in fruit and fibres hard to beat. It's the only bit of fun you'll get round here. A bowl of Kellogg's fruit and fibres really neat. Lots of fruit and nuts and flakes of pure whole wheat. Mm -hmm. Apples, hazelnuts, bananas, raisins, coconuts, sultanas. It's, it's one, one thing you can, can be sure goes, goes down a treat. Karen's parole board is soon. She's being questioned by the police. But the question is, will she let anything slip? But the road is here, prisoners too. When morning comes... More capers with the cons of Wentworth next Tuesday, 11.25. Coming up next, the 39 Steps. There have been three versions of this John Buchan classic. In 1978, starring Robert Powell, the original, directed by Alfred Hitchcock in 1935, starring Robert Donat as Richard Hanney, and the 1959 version that we're showing tonight, starring Kenneth Moore as Hanney, gives it a touch more humour. That's our classic film coming up next.